Hey, greetings friends. Uh, welcome to the twerk shop. Uh, I wanted to share something I've been working on. I've uh, got tired of buying these uh, disposable uh, $20, $30 webcams. Um, so I'm working on a project to build my own. Uh, this module here is something you can order online uh, from all the usual suspects. They uh, generally sold for security cams, doing uh, industrial processes and whatnot, but there's a huge different variety. You got your enclosure. So I'm looking to put together one myself. You can uh, get a customized cable for as long as you want it. Um, I had this idea that I wanted to pick up one of these because I wanted to see if, you know, every few years I could replace this. It's a standard size. I think it's 38 by 38 millimeter. And so I can fit it in here, fit this all up, and uh, we'll go ahead and test it um, and see how it works out. I'm hoping it's a pretty decent webcam. Um, because ultimately, you have a couple different classes of webcam. You've got the $1,000 deal for professional vloggers. They're basically like a high-end mirrorless camera. Didn't want to spend that much. You've got the $200 Logitech Nonsense, which is probably at best $30 of parts. So I wanted to kind of custom pick what I wanted in it uh, so that I could put it together and have exactly what I was looking for. Um, you can find, like I was mentioning these, these are as a Sony chip. Uh, so you can get everything custom and put it together. So I'll uh, do another video when uh, I have this all together. You can see what it looks like. Um, and total cost for this, uh, the module is about 30. The enclosure is about, uh, say, 10. Uh, the extra long uh, USB cable is, uh, let's say it's another $10. So maybe 50 bucks all total, all in. Um, hopefully it looks pretty good. We'll see what that looks like here in a little bit. And I just want to throw it out there for anybody who is interested in kind of doing their own thing and putting it together. Not too hard. Uh, cool thing about these modules is they're plug and play in Windows. Already tested it. Windows picked it up. Windows 11. Nothing to do there. Works for Linux. Uh, so right out of the box, you're good to go. All right. Well, I'll check in with you a little bit once we have this plugged in and we'll see what it looks like.